Anna and uh, today I'm just gonna be unboxing some of the fitness gear that I got online so a little back story um, is that I only just started being active in my life basically for the last couple of months and so I am working with a, a very very small pool of exercise clothing that I am just rotating so every day I have to find myself like washing a lot of it so I decided to just purchase a little bit more since I am going for classes like six times a week and uh, I've been wanting to put up like content online for a while now I haven't really thought about like what what the channel is going to be called but you know what I am just going to stop procrastinating and just you know just film this and put it up first and then we'll see how it goes from there so yeah so I did get it from Taobao and Taobao is like the China equivalent of Amazon and so basically you know you click into the different shops and and you can actually browse what they have it's a uh, it's like an eBay sort of as well um, but rather than just selling like one-offs they do have stocks so um, I this entire haul was like 1.5 kg is worth of stuff and um, they're all fitness related because that's all I'm doing right now and uh, this one is pretty unexciting it is uh, it says exercise resistant mini loop bands and this was very very inexpensive but I just thought that you know if I was going to be doing some workout at home then this would be very useful and so it comes in like different intensities so I got the middle one because I wasn't really sure which one to pick it looks okay, it actually feels really thick and it also came with this um, instruction manual and exercise guide. I'm just going to take a look at this later but for now this is the resistance band but it does feel really good quality, very thick actually and yes it's got resistance and it's not snapping yet so I am supposing that this is this works very well. So this is that. I'm really more excited for the clothes really. I have been running out of good sports bras. Um, now I'm still rotating things in my workout wardrobe that I do not like or I don't feel that comfortable wearing but only because I don't have enough. So hopefully this batch of clothes would help to solve it. And um, so the thing about these shorts I really like this stuff um, but this one in particular I had to really make sure that I didn't get one with the branding on it because I don't know if you can see it it is just it's just kind of tragic and they had those they had those really loud um, prints like almost like the the Nike shirt I'm wearing now where, where it just had the brand name across or like you know at the bra straps and I was just like no so I did get quite a number of items from them um, sports bras just tees that I can wear on the outside this is just one of those nice like mm, not really cross back open back exercise tops I guess and it feels really quite nice and soft so I do kind of like it it's like um dusty pink kind of color a little bit on the shorter side but it's okay and this is how the back of it looks like so you can see that it's an open back here and then it's crossed at the bottom yeah so i'm gonna go and try it on and see how it looks so this top on is really more of a crop fit but would go well with some high waist leggings and I do really like the small details in the top like the run sides as well as the open back and there are also no open hems which is what I expected so this top is really pretty well made and I'm really liking it. This one is a racer back tank top and um, it's quite sheer. Like you can definitely see like what sports bra you're wearing but I just thought I'll get this because I don't actually have a like a pastel mint um, anything really and I thought this was quite nice so it actually is quite soft but I definitely cannot compare to this pink one that I'm wearing yeah so this one is really really soft but this feels very lightweight it's definitely very ventilated and this is just a simple like kind of eraser back design and it's also a lot longer so 
we can go and try this on. So this is one of the few basic tops that you can definitely wear for your workout or even out. Uh, the material is very very thin though and unfortunately I have already made a hole in mine because it snagged onto my watch band so I can't say much about the quality but if you're not as clumsy as me then perhaps you can get this one because I really really like the colour. Honestly, pretty basic. The material actually feels luxurious. Like it's very, very soft. It does feel like it's premium quality, very smooth, almost like leggings. Does have padding, and in I realized in a lot of these like um, Taobao bras that they have pretty thick padding. This particular is like a push-up padding. I'm not complaining about it though because I do like the thicker paddings as compared to like those that you can find in like Forever 21 bras because these are a whole lot more rigid and they don't have these creases or they don't like fold into themselves when you wash it so I do find that these kind of tend to last longer but it is a fairly straightforward one with the straps it's a very very skinny eraser bag so we're just gonna go and try that on so this is a basic sports bra with removable bra pads and with medium support and uh, the combination of the colour as well as the cutting does make it actually really flattering and pretty feminine so I do like this particular sports bra and would definitely recommend it. And this is also another sports bra. You can see that this is also a strappy one. This particular one has like elastic so this material is different once it hits the straps and then on the back as well you can see that there is this cross like two crosses i did really like it but one of the reasons why i got it was because the product description said that this bra is wine red this is not wine red this is more like a i almost want to say like a rancid tomato this sounds really bad. The colour is honestly not that bad, but it's definitely not wine red. Oh yeah, something else as well that they had a little feature is this little mesh semi-circle window in the front, which is great if you perspire a lot at the area, which I do. So <laughs> let's hope that this little mesh area would help things out a little bit. So even though this is a strappy sports bra, I do find that it does support pretty well and it is of uh, high coverage and the straps have been holding up really really well, it hasn't stretched out although I have been using it pretty frequently for my workouts and regarding that semicircle window, I can't exactly say if it has done anything for the ventilation because I still do find sweat in the area but overall, I do like this one. So the next parcel that was in the package as well when I received that, it almost seemed like it was a document it was, it's really really like thin this is actually from a brand called Andar Anda and it's a Korean brand apparently and people were just raving about it this um, in Taobao standards for some of the Taobao stuff or like if you're just comparing to some of the sports bras that I got earlier they're actually quite comparatively more expensive so the sports bras were all ranging from about 15 sing dollars and this particular one was almost 50 dollars so this was almost like the price of half of my package there so this is definitely something that I was looking forward to getting and hopefully it would be a good pair of leggings because we all know that good leggings are so hard to find so let's just take a look at this I did get it in a dark blue colour it's from Korea it's Lycra it's Tactile and it's Polygen odor control so you can wear more and wash less basically it does look like any pair or any regular pair of leggings these have a relatively high waistband and uh, on the back of course there is the logo and of course it has that, that contour, that butt dip which supposedly makes your butt look better so we can give this a try
I do have to say that these leggings were definitely a good purchase and to add on to that my bar instructor also asked me where they were from after the very first time I wore them so I'm gonna be taking that as a thumbs up uh, the leggings do exactly as you would want a legging to do it is lightweight it feels really good and it's very high-waisted so I would definitely recommend this one the name is um, Huan Xing Ma Jia Xian, which in Mandarin, it's basically awakening your pecs or like, you know, your, your abs. But if you would take a look at the English translation of the shop, it is simply called abdominal muscles. <laughs> okay, but anyway, abdominal muscles must have had some really, really good stuff because I. I bought quite a number. This isn't, oh, this isn't a sports bra. These are shorts. Okay, so I got these shorts. Oh, and they look cute. Look at this waistband. I've never seen a waistband. I didn't know it came like that. I bought it because I did like this, this sheer thing going on at the bottom. This particular one does have the... Uh, the tights in it so that you know it doesn't like flip up and you I don't have any shots that look like that so let's go try it on so after wearing them a couple of times, I do have to say that they kind of do look like any ordinary black exercise shorts from afar. You can't really tell the black mesh detailing. They have no pockets, but I do like that very, very special waistband that it features on the back. So overall, it's okay. <laughs> so this is a sports bra. I got this because it is somewhat like convertible which I thought was quite good so you can see that this is like extra mesh area like this this is the bra ends here and then this is extra mesh area here which you can either hide and kind of wear it like a regular black sports bra or you can kind of pull it out and make it longer so if you got like bloats that day and you want to hide a little bit of that thing going on then I guess this is really good. I thought that was really interesting. I haven't seen a sports bra like that. So I'm just going to try this on and see if you can really wear it both ways. This is unfortunately one of those that I've tried on once but have never worn out ever since mainly because it is pretty tricky and tight to put on. It does feel a little bit gimmicky. The convertible thing does work and it is easy to convert it into the longer mode but to put it back while you're wearing it, it is quite a chore. So unfortunately, this isn't one of the sports bras that I would reach for. Roll sports bra and um, let's see okay I think I did get this one and what I liked about it was that along the edge there was this mesh so it does kind of like change up the, the design a little bit um, I don't know why the inside is white I don't know if you'll be able to see that when I'm wearing it but we'll see you later on it's just got like two white straps at the back like that these cups don't feel as rigid so let's go try that on so I really like how this one looks like from the front, that mesh detailing at the edge also is a very very nice touch and it does look very very feminine. However, when it comes on to the back, that big cross at the back is the main issue. It cuts into your shoulder blade and it just makes any movement very very uncomfortable. Plus, that bit of fat that's poking through two of the straps that run across, this bra is a no-go. And I totally know why I got this as well. I actually don't like purple, but <laughs> like when it comes to sports bras, that's okay, I guess. And I think this is the reason why I got it. Can you see this? Okay, it's not holographic. It's a color shifting strip. And it's there on both sides. On the back, actually it's quite nice as well. It has a, a little bit mesh here just for ventilation I guess. And then there is this dip racer back detail. <laughs> but this is it so I'm just going to go ahead and try this on and let's see how it goes. 
I feel like there's nothing much for me to say. This is a very basic sports bra that definitely does its job. Uh, when I'm wearing it, I can't actually really even see the color changing strip. But overall, it is very comfortable and it is of pretty high support as well. Okay, and that is it for the unboxing for my Taobao fitness gear. I think it was a good purchase. Like, this is not my first time buying fitness gear on Taobao. I really can't complain about the price because, like, I've got five sports bras here. Five of these. You can kind of see, like, <laughs> this color scheme thing going on. I've got two tops. Um, I've got a pair of shorts, a pair of leggings, and these were all just a little bit off a hundred sing dollars um not including shipping but shipping wasn't crazy expensive as well so for this amount of stuff i think it was super super worth it and oh but meanwhile i am super happy with my loot and um, if you guys like i would actually link them down below if you need help ordering on taobao you can approach me as well and i hope you enjoyed the video and if there's any way that I can improve please feel free to let me know and hopefully i will get to put up more content because i've been meaning to do it for ages and and this is it so i hope this is okay see you guys